if uh, sleep is invading your life just any time of the day, you eat only twenty-four morsels of food. You will see, in the morning you will wake up at 3.30. To every mouthful, you choose twenty-four times. You will see food will not cause dullness. Probably you will never fall sick if you eat like that. time you sit for meditation, if it so happens that you're tending to fall asleep, I want you to understand what it is, first of all. Most people, not most people, lot of people in the world cannot sleep even when they want to sleep. Yes. Lot of people go to bed and desperately try to sleep and they cannot sleep. They have to pop a pill to sleep. This is the condition of millions and millions of people on the planet. So, <clears throat> if uh, sleep is invading your life just any time of the day, one thing is, fundamental thing is to check up your basic health. Just checking, is something wrong with your system, physically wrong, that you're going through a certain… you have noticed you're not well. When you're not well, you sleep much more than normal, isn't it? Because something is happening in the body which does not allow enough energy to do other things, it wants to rest. First thing is that. The second thing is the food that you eat. So, uh, if you… you must do, you know, generally, for people who are on the yogic path, you know what they say? You should eat only twenty-four morsels. I'm not saying this to everybody. Um, if you are noticing that you're tending to fall asleep through the day, you eat only twenty-four morsels of food, that is twenty-four mouthfuls. Why twenty-four? I will not go into that number business now, but there is a science behind it. You only eat twenty-four mouthfuls. Mouthful does not mean So essentially, your alertness depends on how keenly you manage your energies. And this is crucial if you want to meditate. Not doing fifteen minutes shunya, if you want to become meditative in your life process, this alertness, alertness not of the mind alone, alertness of your energy, that your energy is alert, to keep it in an alert state is why you're doing the sadhana. So to assist it, you eat only twenty-four morsels. Try from dinner or you want to try… do it tomorrow <laughs> Shall we try in this dinner or tomorrow? Now if you do eat only twenty-four morsels, normal-sized morsels, you will see in the morning you will wake up at 3.30. Yes. In the Indian way of looking at time, there is something called as a nimisha which has something to do with twenty-four. That's why you eat twenty-four. You eat twenty-four and still you must take the same time that somebody who is eating a full meal, whoever just see… whoever eats maximum in the ashram, just see their plate till they get up. You must be sitting right there. Not simply sitting, you must chew. To every mouthful, you choose twenty-four times. One, two, three, four, chew it twenty-four times. Now you will see, you will take more time than anybody else, but your food is pre-digested in your mouth before it goes in. It will not cause dullness if you chew your food sufficiently, 
you will see it will not… food will not cause dullness if it is masticated in the mouth region. Then morning you will wake up at 3.30, what do I do Sadhguru? Just what you ask, meditate. <laughs> You'll feel hungry at three o'clock, 3.30, you're up, drink one glass of water and sit. If you feel drowsy, even with water, it's all right, still there's time for 5.30, you can doze a bit. Or when you wake up, first thing you finish your toilet and stuff, have a shower, leave your hair wet, you will survive till eight o'clock in the sadhana time without sleeping. And uh, tomorrow's morning meal also, if you eat twenty-four, no way you are going to sleep till dinner time. Chew it well. If you chew it well, the digestive process, one and a half, two hours you'll be hungry and that's a way to stay. Hunger does not mean you have to… if stomach is empty, does not mean you have to put food, you just have to put water. And uh, you will stay alert, you will be very energetic, you will not lose any weight because your system will learn to use the food that you've eaten well rather than simply wasting it. It's uh, both economically and ecologically very good for the world and very good for your health. Probably you'll never fall sick if you eat like that. So twenty-four morsels of food, you must chew twenty-four times each morsel fully, you must become like paste before you eat it. You will see you will do wonderfully well, you can meditate.